Hey guys, what's up? Sarah Jane. Thank you for coming back to my YouTube channel. So as you might have been seeing, I've been able to get some more editing done with a new software that I found. I am starting to work with music, so this is going to be my first vlog in a while. So as I was getting ready to go to a tr on a trip to Minnesota with my family, I found something outside of my door when I was about to go do errands and you're about to find out what it was. Um, I hope you guys enjoy. I just found this outside my door and now I'm concerned. What the hell? Call Tony. What is going on? So I've been living here for about a year. We've gotten gunshots and all this other shit. This is the first time this has ever happened. Finally got a hold of Tony. He did not give me the bear. Granted, I checked it for cameras and stepped on it and tried to figure out, you know, just in case. But I'm wondering if it's for the person across from me so they can see it. But it's really freaking creepy. <laughs> I'm not okay. <laughs> um, I'm hoping I find out. Hopefully it's gone by the time I get back home. I am on my way to go uh, get groceries and stuff because of course, uh, day before I leave for Minnesota, for my Minnesota trip with my family, um, I'm not packed. I'm just gonna go get groceries to make tacos tonight. I'm a little freaked out. I don't know if any of you would be. Uh, let me know in the comments if it was you or uh, if you have any <laughs> ideas about it. Don't freak me out too much because I'm already freaked out. So, what is going on? So Tony found out who did it. His co-worker Ray decided to put it there so we would have it because they were gonna throw it out and it was free. And I like fluffy things. I only like them when I know where they came from. You can't do anything nice and just expect you to know what's going on. You have to let me know because I was so scared I left it back out on, uh, in, in front of my door. So if it's there when I get back, it's there. But if it's not, I'm gonna be kind of freaked out. Um, but okay with it, because then it's gone. I know, it's weird. While all this stuff has been going on with this weird teddy bear, I just had a, a realization that I haven't even packed for my vacation yet. I kind of need to get packed because by tomorrow morning I need to have everything ready to go before I leave. I've been packing uh, for my trip finally since I knocked on my neighbor's door. I didn't answer so I couldn't ask him why he would leave this thing. but. I just kicked it over. It was staring at me this whole time and it was creeping me out. I'm just trying to figure out what else I bring and how I figure this out. So we're working on it. We're probably, this honestly is like the most hardest part is getting the clothes in the bag and being comfortable with what clothes you bring. So I have these um, for workout slash sleeping if I need them and then I have another set of pajamas in there. I have like five dresses because that's all I really wear. 
I got ice cream. Um, place called Ollie's behind me. It is one of the best places for frozen custard in DeKalb and Sycamore even, I would say. It's one of the best ones I've had. Like they do some really good ones. I had, they had a pumpkin spice last year that I really liked. Um, they have a peaches and cream one that's to die for. Like I love their peach one. And then this one's key lime pie. And it's got little um, graham cracker pieces in it. On a waffle cone, beautiful. Okay, so I'm almost done packing. I just need to pack up snacks and maybe some drinks. Probably buy a monster too before I head out because I feel like I'm going to drive for a good chunk of it. Um, right now I'm making dinner for Tony. We're doing tacos because it's been a while. Um, I'm just nervous because I have uh, I've never I haven't gone on vacation in a long time. And I'm probably gonna drive some. Uh, I'm, I got some green grapes for Tony because he likes them. And I prepared and got him some um, sliced cheese and some meat, lunch meat for him because I wanna make sure he eats well, we're gone. So we have tons of, of cereal and we have a uh, half a gallon of milk. Well, half of a half a gallon of milk, so. I should be ready to go. So thanks for getting ready with me, you guys, and freaking out about a weird teddy bear. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.